Why are bakers so rich? They make a lot of dough. Straight bread. Welcome to Mecha Cartoon Cat vs Mecha Siren Head. Today we're finding out which of the Robo Beasts is the best. But first, remember to subscribe. It's free. And I'm yellow. <laughs> So if you're unfamiliar with these creatures, here they are. Here's the cat. Oh, the cat's just farted on me and I've died. 22,000 health. Here's the Simon. 65,000. He's a bit bigger, but you can turn him off. And now he sleeps. But our first test is just to see who hits the hardest. And for that, I need to eat some food. So uh, so both those monsters, they, they will one-shot me. So I need to gain some health. And to do that, I'm eating McDonald's. Look at it. <laughs> and 10,000 health. It says 1,000, but trust me, it's 10,000. And we'll begin with the cat. Hit me. Oh my god, what happened? What happened? No, stop it. How much did he do with the initial blast? We need an instant replay. That was a lot of damage. All right, now stay away, you. So now it's Simon's turn. And hopefully he doesn't one-shot me. I've got 6,146 health left. Hit me, Simon. Oh god, what's happening? Oh, that's small damage. It's small. It's real small. I think the cat's definitely gonna have won this one. Oh, although that was a lot. But we're counting his first attack, which is the bullets. Stop it. Turn him off. Oh god, I've turned him off. And so the cat scored a heavy and Simon a not so heavy, which means the cat is winning 1-0. Round two is just going to be your classic 1v1. Simon versus cat. The cat's already started farting. He's done a bit of damage, but the siren head has just regened it. He can do that. And also you can tell that he senses an enemy nearby. He's glowing red. He's very advanced. So let's find out who's going to win. Oh, Simon just nuked him. Fair enough. All right, it's 1-1. One, one. Okay. Challenge number three is to see who's the fastest. So they have to start on this red line and run all the way to Mia over here. If they teleport, it counts. Starting with the cat and we turn him on. And oh my god, the speed. That has got to be a world record. Holy moly, that was epic. All right, the cat's time is. Simon, you're up next. So we've plonked him right on the line just like the cat was. And all he's got to do is come get me. But I think uh, he's choosing Oh, he chose violence. Uh, he's coming, though. He's coming. No, the cat's definitely won this. That was Simon, that was pretty epic. I'll give you that. But it's 2-1 to the cat. Challenge number four. Can they escape from inside my crate? So we've got a we got a pretty big crate because it needs to fit both of them. Um, the cat's up first. Let's just drop this crate down. Oh, no, I missed. Oh, what's happening? Okay, it flipped. We're good. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's just really big. This time for sure. All right, there's the crate. It's on the cat. He's in there. Excellent. Can he get out? Let's find out. Yeah. <laughs> How has he done that? The crate didn't even move. Okay, can Simon escape? I've plonked him in. Um, He seems to already have turned on the crate. He's doing some kind of flippy thing, you know, when people do with the signs at the restaurants. Um, That's coming towards me. What is happening? Am I going to die? Simon, can you put the crate back on you? Okay, here we go. We're just going to drop it on him. Not a problem. Not a problem. It's as big as it'll get. What is happening? Simon, just get in there, would you, man? All right, there we go. We're turning him on. Is he? He's just done it again. All right, nobody gets a point. You're both banned. Our next challenge is a pretty tricky one. 50 Jerry's. Let us turn the cat around so we can see his opponents. It's kind of a dream come true. Can he kill all 50? Oh, wait, these Jerry's, they seem to like him. Oh, no. Oh, there's some of them seem a little nervous. They're getting it slightly nervous. Guys, fight him. It seems like they think he's some sort of god. They don't want to get too close. So I think we're going to call it a win for the cat. Instead of killing the Jerry's, he tamed them. He's a genius. Simon, on the other hand, will he have as much success? Will the Jerry's fear him? Only one way to find out. No, they, they're going for him. They're getting yeeted. Half of them are dead already. There's, they're falling from the sky. They formed a lovely line. Oh, they're getting zapped. Lads, do something. Get Oh, one got ripped in half. Oh, my God. Oh, and there goes the nuke. I'd say that's a point each, which means the scores are three to two with the cat in the lead. The next challenge is to face the banana lucky block. It contains one of me, but a more powerful... You've killed it. You've killed the... That doesn't count. You cheat. It contains a powerful version of me, uh, like this guy. 900,000 health. He is dying, though, but he's got a pirate hat and a cannon. He is a pirate. All right, let's turn him around. Good luck. You're gonna need it. Oh, what happened? Is he winning? He's getting zapped. The cat slowly comes. Oh, he's just run through him. Use the cannon, man. Oh, what's happening? Oh, my God. He got 
got electrocuted, but then just one shot him with the tank shell. He was biding his time. He only took 5,000 damage. All right, no point for the cat. Is that a banana? It's Simon's turn. Will Simon get us lucky? What is going on? Is that banana going to hell? <laughs> get back down here now. And his foe is, oh my goodness. Look at the blade on this dude. He's a gladiator, but only 220,000 health. God, he's sexy. And Simon's recognized him as a foe. He's gone pink. And let's see if he can win. He's, oh, he's gone immediately nuclear. And, oh, 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 use that blade, man. Is he doing, how's he doing? Is he, is he winning? Is, he's gone nuclear for the second time. How's the damage reduction on this banana? He seems to be doing all right. And, oh, he's picked me up. What happened? What's going on? He's still alive. There's banana blood everywhere. Siren is, is it half health? He's just keeping him at bay with the lasers. Oh, and he's got him. As a point for Simon, which means it's three all. Our next challenge is to see if either of them can kill me when I'm inside my lovely medieval home. Isn't it beautiful? It doesn't have any furniture. And maybe I should have shut that window. I'm sure we're fine. Let's just turn him on. Oh, oh it's keeping him at bay. He can't even. Oh, wait, he's, he's leaving. He's, oh, no, he's having another run at it. Oh, he's, he's actually really smart. Oh, and he somehow shot me through the wall. Okay, I guess that's a point. Now it's Simon's turn. Open. He has a bit of a height advantage, so maybe he can shoot me through the upper windows. Only one way to find out. Uh-oh, has he seen me? He's seen me. Oh, the walls. Oh, and he did. He got me actually through a window. Let's have that in slow motion. That bullet. Oh, he just thread the needle. That's a point each. So it's 4-4. Four, four. Our next challenge is to see if they can defeat their real selves. So Robo versus... It's just the cat. We will need to set their relationship to hate one another because they are friends technically. And this cat's already hurt. Uh-oh. <laughs> and let's turn him on. Oh. Oh, he's going for him. He's always... Oh, oh, he's got the distance advantage. Cat, do something. Oh, he's trying to headbutt him. That is... <laughs> That is not going to work. He's way too fast for that. Although you missed. And there we go. He's just absolutely plowed him. Now it's Robo Simon's turn and he has to fight himself. The new version of himself. And you hate you and you hate you. Let's turn him on and see how it goes. Oh, immediately. Just dead. This Simon might be a slight upgrade. That's a point each, which means it's five all. Up next, we got another lucky block challenge and it's just a random Trevor Henderson creature. Would you stop doing that? And quickly, let's open it before he kills it again. It's... Oh, it's milk. All right, cats, cats love milk. Oh, he's killing him already. It's so unfair. He's just, oh, hang on. Hang, oh, milk's going for it. Oh, he's peeled off his mask so he can see better. And he's, and he's dead and tiny. Oh, no, don't climb over the body. Oh, the cat did take some damage, though. But now it's Simon's turn. Will he get as lucky with something easy? Oh, it's a giant shark. <laughs> no, he won't. It's the aircraft shark with 750,000 health. Who do you think is going to win? Well, let's find out. I'm confused. Who's what's happening? The shark's going bananas. Oh, the shark's got balls. Is he killed? I think he killed him. Oh, he took some damage though. But that means the cat gets a point for that round, meaning he takes the lead again. Six five. I wonder if the shark likes me. No, sharks don't like bananas. I'm a biologist. Now we recently learned that it required a robot to take out King Kong. But can either of these robots take out King Kong? Oh no, <laughs> Kong Wei. Did you hurt the? cat. You've hurt the cat, Kong. All right, we got a fresh one. Good luck. Oh, no, I forgot to turn them off me. Oh, God. Well, no, he's killed the cat immediately. Kong, we didn't even see it. Again, for science, do the thing. Oh, the cat's coming. And oh, there it is. He's just, okay. Maybe Simon will do a better job. Maybe Kong's just too strong. Oh, he's taking damage, though. The screaming, the multi-directional screaming. He's taking a punch, a stomp, and more punches. He's in his groin floating. It's a little sus, Simon, I'll be honest. I would get out of there he's dead. All right. He listened. Nobody gets a point. Kong can have a point for the booty. So the scores are still six to five with the cat in the lead. And for their next challenge. Oh, no. Don't you do the screaming. Don't you do it. It's a troll's lucky block. Oh, nice try. Will the cat get lucky? Oh, I think the cat did get really quite lucky. It's Derpina. Will the cat immediately flatten it? Let's find out. Oh, yep. No, just ran through her. Cat took a lot of damage though, but there's a point for the cat. Will the siren head get off as light as the cat did with the trolls. Oh, it's the imperfect trolls. Only 5,000 health. I think he's got lucky too. Let's see. Yep, immediately dead. All right, that's a point each. Seven to six. So for the final round, for the cat to take the win or for it to be declared a tie, things just got a little more difficult. We've seen them fight their original selves, but now they have to fight their jacked selves. It's the bodybuilding cat. Oh, he's just rammed it. Where are you going? What are you doing? Stop running away. <laughs> 
He's just fleeing. Oh, he's got his oh, he's got his dumbbells out. Now is he is, does that make him braver? No. He's just still Where are you going? <laughs> What? Oh, oh my god, no way. He baited him and it just absolutely whomped him. Where, are, you, are you going somewhere? All right, no point for the cat. And now it's the sirens. He only needs one dumbbell. Don't ask me why. Let's turn him on. And oh, God. Simon, why? You, why did we add the nuclear option? Which means the scores are now 7-7. Seven, seven. But we definitely need a winner. And to decide that, I'm going to hit both of them. And whoever takes the least damage from the same attack will win. Uh, who can go first? The cat can go first. He's been going first all day. Bonk. All right. That was um, 2,500 damage. Simon, what about you? Bonk. I did one. I did one damage to him. No, that time I did a, a few hundred. Um, so it seems like Simon is our winner. He's the toughest, a, pr a pretty worthy winner. I mean, look at him. Let me know who's your favorite in the comments. And if you, and if you enjoyed this video, remember to subscribe. It's free and I'm yellow.